Hello everyone, this is uh, Hilary, your mortgage coach. Thank you for joining me. Today I am going to talk about an investment strategy that I personally like and also I have a lot of my uh, coaching clients who love this uh, strategy and this is investing in student rental. I know there have been so many stories about students trashing houses but for me and a few of my clients, this strategy has been really, really great. And I'm going to give you some tips on how to make a student rental be a good strategy to add into your portfolio. What is a, a student rental? A student rental is uh, where you convert a single family home into several rooms that is uh, rented to a group of students. And we typically rent a single family home to uh, five to seven students, depending on the bylaws of the municipality that you are working in. Why is this strategy great? A single family home would typically rent for around 1800 to $2,000 a month uh, plus utilities. Given the prices of homes in uh, the GTA, these houses uh, typically would not cash flow for uh, investment purposes. The strategy of uh, converting it into a student rental may assist an investor to cash flow in uh, such environments. Why does it cash flow? Student rentals are typically rented to students at various uh, room prices, and the rooms would cost between 450 in the low end to as high as um, $1,000 a month. Most universities have high enrollment rates, and um, typically they do not have enough accommodation for the students. The advantage of uh, having a single family that is accessible to these students would um, help an investor to actually cash flow because first they can get rooms for these students and the students will come as a group and they will rent their whole house. How do we do the student rental? We typically renovate our student rentals to a luxury state where we have um, granite counters, we have uh, very nice hardwood floors, we furnish our rooms. Basically your client is a student who is willing to pay for a premium product and when you do that you remove majority of the competition because then you are getting a student whose parents are willing to pay for a premium product for their students. Uh, we typically furnish these um, student rooms and we also provide um, internet, we provide um, cable TV, we provide TV, we have a sitting room that has um, uh, coaches. Basically the student will uh, just come with their personal essentials like uh, the clothes. They will have a desk, a chair and um, they will have a, a bed. Therefore they do not need to carry uh, furniture in and out of the house. The advantage of this is uh, 